Hello everyone. Welcome to Storytelling Time. My name is Hatmanti Wijaya. You can call me Miss Anti. I am from Maitreya Wira School, Jakarta. So today, Miss Anti is going to do a storytelling with the title The Boy Who Cried Wolf. So, let's get started. Once upon a time, there was a boy who became bored while he was watching the sheep grazing on the hillside. To entertain himself, he decided to do something fun according to him. So he started to cry out, Help! Help! The wolf is chasing the sheep. Hearing the boy's cry, the villagers went up the hill to help the boy chasing the wolf away. Where is the wolf? Where is the wolf? Where is the wolf? asked the villagers. However, they found no wolf. The boy answered easily. Well, sir, actually there was no wolf. I was just playing around, he said. Hearing this, the villagers went upset. Don't scream wolf while there is no wolf, said one of the villagers. So with the angry heart, they went back down the hill. Later on, the shepherd boy decided to do it once more. He thought it was fun. Help! Help! The wolf is chasing the sheep. Hearing the boys cry once again, the sh villagers started to go up the hill to help the boys chasing the wolf away. Where is the wolf? Where is the wolf? Where is the wolf? said the villagers. However, they found no wolf and the boy just put a grin on his face seeing the angry face of the villagers. The villagers went upset and strictly warned the boy, never scream wolf when there is no wolf. Save your fright when the real wolf is coming. So with the grumbling heart, the villagers went back down the hill. Later on that day, the real wolf was coming. It was sneaking on the flock of sheep. Oh! Bah, bah. Alarmed, the shepherd boy jumped out and cried out as loud as he could. Help! Help! The wolf is chasing the sheep. Hearing this, the villagers decided not to go up. They thought that the boy was just fooling them again. However, at the sunset, the villagers decided to look for the boy as they with the sheep, the boy and the sheep had not returned. When they found the boy on the hill, they found him crying. <laughs> What's the matter, boy? asked the villagers. <laughs> the real wolf was coming before. It was here. <sighs> I cried for help, but none of you came to help me. <laughs> now the flock of sheep had gone. He wailed. <laughs> the villagers comforted the shepherd boy. Well, boy, now you have learned your lesson. That nobody believes a liar, even if you are telling the truth. <laughs> I know, sir. I'm so sorry for everything I did before. I promise I would never do that again. So ever since that day, the shepherd boy had learned his lesson. That lying breaks the trust. Nobody will believe us, even if we are telling the truth. So the moral of this story is, always be honest. So that is the story of the boy who cried wolf. I hope you are enjoying my story. Thank you very much and I'll see you again next time. Goodbye!